Megan and I am back today with a new 30 days of sketches layout. So you will have seen the layout that we are using today and I had at the time when I was making this layout, I had been scrapbooking my 2021 uh, album, which is the six by eight size. Um, and so I was kind of having a hard time using this sketch. I knew it would work, but at the same time, I wasn't going to be able to fit six photos on it. So I made the sketch work for the six by eight size. I kind of wish that I just wouldn't have done the six by eight size, but I'm already committed. So it's fine. Anyway, so I have these four photos of my husband's new car and then also Tinian and Jonas sitting in the back of the car and Jonas is hugging Tinian and just being funny. So um, the two photos on the left are Mark looking in his car um, as I think his dad was sitting in the driver's seat because they had just gotten there. So the story behind this car is... Um, Mark got a car a couple weeks after I got a car in 2021. So my birthday present to myself last year was buying myself a new car. And it's kind of funny and Mark doesn't think it's funny, but we initially had started looking for Mark to get a car and not me, but it just kind of worked out with, um, all of the stimulus checks and everything that we were both able to get new cars last year. And, um, also I've gotten a couple of raises at work. And so we both were able to buy new cars, put money down and also get like lower payments on them. So we're not paying like crazy amounts of money for both of our cars because both our cars are pretty new. I think Mark's is a 2017 and mine is a 2018. So not brand new, um, but they are newer. Anyway, so Mark's car actually came from the other side of Idaho um, and his parents live over there. So they actually went and test drove it for him and were trying to vet it to make sure it was a, you know, it was a good car, it was a good deal and everything. And um, so he was pretty excited. He didn't actually get to test drive it or anything like his parents went and did it, said, we love it. It's an awesome car. You should buy it if you can. <laughs> and so we did. We did everything virtually. So like we set up the loan and everything online. And like it was kind of crazy because we've never really bought newer cars. And then to do everything online, it was kind of insane. So his parents... um went and picked it up and they brought it to us. I think it was like a Thursday or a Friday. I don't even remember. I think it was a Friday probably. Um, they brought it to us and, um, like Mark and his dad were just like geeking out over, you know, the technology and like how cool it was and all the things that his car, new car can do and all these things. So, um, it was really a fun experience, but yeah, I don't think we will ever buy cars long distance ever again after that experience. It was a little hard communicating with the dealers. And, um, so we did, I don't know, we had a couple of things that we were like, yeah, I don't think I want to do this ever again. Cause the dealers like didn't really listen to us on everything we felt like. So so anyway, I'm just trying to keep the layout really simple because it is small, but also feel like I'm embellishing. So I'm using this Amy Tangerine cut apart sheet from her. Oh goodness. What collection is this? I am totally drawing a blank, but, um, I don't think I really had used much of this collection. Somebody please tell me what this collection is. Cause I am drawing a complete blank. And I can't even see it sitting over on my my shelf or anything. So I apologize. Um, but look in the comments below if you want to know what this collection is. I'll probably um, leave a, a link in the description so that you can find it if you want it. But anyway, I am just 
trying to get everything down and feel like you can still see everything in the photos. I think that's the hardest thing for me with 6x8 because I love doing multi-photo layouts, number one. And then number two, you don't really have enough space to do multi-photo layouts. So I had four photos that I wanted to get on this layout and not much room to do journaling or embellishing or anything. But I am pretty happy with how it turns out. So this is going to be my title right here, um, Wonderful Party. And I kind of contemplated adding the word car. And I think I might add it just with like some tile letters or something like that right above the word party and next to the word wonderful. So the title will be Wonderful Car Party or something along those lines. Um, so this was April 17th. 2021 and yeah Mark is still in love with his bright yellow car and um yep it's all good um so yeah I don't really have anything else to say <laughs> I've said everything apparently um but the thing that the kids loved about it was that they could climb into the back into the trunk so it's a pretty small car but for how small the car is, the trunk is pretty big. Um, and the same goes for my car. Like, my car is quite a bit bigger than Mark's. But um, even in that vein, it's still a compact SUV. Um, and so both of our cars have pretty big cargo spaces in the back, which is nice. Because, you know, if we do go on trips and things, we need room. And there's no way we're letting the dogs into our nice cars. <laughs> Like I can let the, I'll take the dogs to the vet and I'll put them in the back of my car and it's fine because it's a huge area. So they don't feel so claustrophobic, but, um, I have to like talk to them so that they don't jump onto the back seat because my dogs are bad dogs. Anyway, sorry, totally got off on a tangent. Now I'm adding some pretty gems from close to my heart. And that is it for this layout. Make sure you check out all of the links below. And also there's a bunch of people posting on Instagram. Um, so make sure to check out the, over there on Instagram. The hashtag will be below. I think it's just hashtag 30 uh, CBL. Um, oh my goodness, D S. Sorry, <laughs> I totally drew a blank. Or I think it's 30 D S C B L. That's what it is. Anyway, thank you for watching. Bye.